Hello, hi, I'm Siti from Smart Excel, where we are very much specialized in getting primary and secondary students to score their best in the PSLE and the GCEO level examination. Alright, for this tutorial, it will be P4, P4 Chapter 2, Multiplication and Division, Question 7. Alright, okay. Jane went shopping with thrice as much money as Mary. After Jane spent $200, Mary had twice as much money as Jane had left. How much money did Jane bring along for the shopping than Mary? Okay. Uh, for Let's read the question one more time. Jane went shopping with thrice as much money as Mary. From these questions, we already know there must be two models. One is for Jane, one is for Mary. And the first statement, they mentions that Jane has thrice as much money as Mary. So when we draw model, okay, when we draw model, we're going to have Jane and we're going to have Mary and Jane is thrice. Okay, like that. Okay, so done for the first after Jane after Jane spent two hundred dollars, Mary had twice as much money as Jane's left. So in this second statement they mentioned that Jane spent but your Mary remains the same, doesn't spend. So therefore this uh, Mary this this Mary remain constant, right? So and they tells you now your your Mary left with twice. So from this one unit, you must break it into two to make it twice. Because you break this into two, the bottom, the top also you must break into two. Okay, cut into two. And the three dots that I put here are the remaining, the left. Okay, so therefore the rest of this all must cut. And this is what she spent. Okay. And when she spent, how much does she spend? She spent two hundred dollars. So this is your two hundred dollars. Okay. So from here, they asked you how much man, how much more money does Jane bring than Mary? Means they are asking for, uh, this extra here. Alright. So from here, we can see quite obviously, here to here, it is one. 2, 3, 4, 5 unit. So 5U is equivalent to the $200. So we find 1U which is 200 divide 5 which will give us 40. And because of this question mark that they want, it is actually 1, 2, 3, 4. So we find 4U. And we take 40 times 4. So the answer become 160. Alright. So I hope this question is simple enough for you to understand. Um, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.